It is 8 a.m. We are bright-eyed and bushy-tailed and we are going on our first family vacay! Daddy is filling up the trunk with our suitcases and we is having a little bit of breakfast before we go to the airport. She loves her puffs and she's also eating on some pineapples. We got matching shoes. You matching with mommy? We're waiting to board our flight. Ray is drinking her milk. Daddy's feeding it to her. And mama has her hands free. Excited for the first family vacation. But I am a little bit worried because I did check the weather. It says it's gonna rain all week. We'll see. But it rains a lot in the Caribbean anyway, so not too worried about it. Yeah. It'll just be good to have some time away from responsibilities except this little responsibility right here. <laughs> yeah, you. But yeah, we are excited and we'll catch you guys in the pop. So after a long afternoon of traveling and customs, customs took the longest. There's no global entry apparently, or it wasn't running today, so it took even longer. I think they were short staffed, right? We're standing at the reef in Paradise yeah. Island. At Atlantis, ah. yes. At Atlantis. Ah. So, <laughs> That's what she was saying, at ah, ah, Atlantis. The, the biggest options were the cove and the reef, and the reef was just more baby friendly. As you can see, come over here. We have the little kitchenette area. The biggest you know, thing for us was just having a sink so we can clean Ray's bottles, prepare her stuff and all that. TV right here. Coffee. That is what it is. This is considered ocean view. Yes, Ray. We'll be disappointed, but we'll see. What? It is an ocean. What? I like this view. You okay. kind of wanted to see more of the a ocean? A little bit more. This, this is really nice. But look! This is a beautiful view. You're disappointed by this? Yeah, not really. We're also on the top floor. Okay. 22nd floor, so we are as high up as you can get. The water is beautiful. Um, we literally get to see all the action. So again, I think this is the cove right across. Like, partner resort. So we have access to everything they have access to. Don't fall now. Couch area, some activities. For activities, what activities? Activities. <laughs> Safe closet. Saw you. In a nice, spacious bathroom. This is a nice bathroom. With a tub, ready for the bath. Oh yeah! Oh my goodness! The sink, the private toilet, so the can poop. <laughs> shower and that concludes the tour. Yeah, I was actually worried about how I was going to be able to give Rhea a bath. Mm-hmm. Eh? Yep. Mm-hmm. But we can have bath time. But they are bringing our little girl a crib, so that's great. They just recommended that we brought a crib sheet and Mama packed that, so we're just going to unpack again. Let me change this girl's dirty diaper. And we can get our night started. Yeah. 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 Yeah, baby. Yeah. Happy baby. Yeah. Oh. 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 So it's sadly raining, but we are going to head to dinner. And thankfully, it's a covered pathway all the way over to the other building. Very convenient, because I was not trying to get wet. So 
Somebody's tired. Headband all twisted. Baby girl was falling asleep. Thankfully, we are sitting in a booth, so it's over here just chilling. This is their conch. They said it's scorched, scorched, and they highly recommended it. So we're gonna give it a try. We had a very good dinner. Rhea fell asleep. Well, you would have seen that, but she fell asleep and then now she's up. But mommy and daddy are winded. <laughs> he already got his bonnet on. <laughs> dinner was good. Um, variety of options. Fresh seafood. Fresh seafood, it, it was pricey. But I mean, you kind of expect that coming on vacation. A little yeah. more expensive than I thought, but it was good. Um, the conch. Con okay, so it's, I think we've just been saying it wrong. Uh, we being the general public, but it's I mean, spelled conch, like, you know, the conch episode in Spongebob, Spongebob, whatever. But they say conch. So you eat the conch, and I truly didn't know what to expect, um, but it was very fresh. Yeah, pronounced conch. I'll take a picture of it. Yeah, so everybody's been saying conch. Well, whatever. But um, it's a local dish and it tasted really good, really fresh. Don't mind Rhea. She's teething. But yeah, it was really good. We had that, we had the mahi, we tried their jerk chicken. Yep. We had their hush puppies and that was really good. And then we got a chocolate paradise for dessert. Yeah, it's like chocolate mousse mm -hmm. with chocolate crumbles and vanilla ice cream. No, not vanilla ice cream, but it tastes like vanilla, but some local flavor ice cream. It seemed like almost like a sorbet, but it was like vanilla. Yeah. But yeah. The, the jerk sauce was different. Um, which is why I wanted to try it. Like I've been to Jamaica and I've had Jamaican jerk sauce. I've had Americanized jerk sauce. I've had jerk in other places in the Caribbean. Even though we're technically not in the Caribbean, but you know. Um, but it was like a hot sweet sauce. Not in a normal jerk way. So, but it was good. Good, different. Rhea is going ham on these cups. She is imagining that there is some water or milk in there. Wait, yeah. <laughs> we had a very chill first day, but I mean, it was very long as far as traveling goes. I mean, the flight itself was only an hour and a half. So it was mainly getting through customs and all that. But for now, we're just chilling with little Rhea before I take a bath with her and she goes to sleep. We also have to wait for them to set up the crib. I was actually just preparing our stuff for Ray and I to take a bath and I was sad because I didn't bring any bubble bath because I didn't expect there to be a tub. But, excuse you Ray, she burped. They also brought in a crib and they gave some bubble bath. Bye, some bubbles. So we're gonna have some fun and get clean and go to bed. Good morning. Boop. Hi, guys. <laughs> and it kind of sound like that. Hi, guys. What are we gonna do today, Weiwei? We go to the beach. So, since these two wanted to go to bed at 8.30 p.m., 
I mean, I went to bed too, because there was nothing for me to do. We are up in Adam, bright and early at, well, really we got up at like 5.45. So we're gonna head to the beach super early and explore because there's a whole island that we need to walk around. Thankfully from our, um, from our balcony, we can literally see like the whole island. We can see where the little water park is, the marina village and all that. So kind of just making a mental map before we go out and explore. And I don't know why I look red right now, but oh. Traveling with a baby means you're in for the night early and you're out early too. And she's out early on her first nap. Yep, and it's not even nine yet. We're out here so early the towel towers aren't even open. The water here is so clear. Do you see all those little fish? There's so many of them. They're gonna run away from me, but. We found this little tent on Amazon. It was literally like $30. And you can put water in the middle. So if she wants to do some water play under the shade, she can. It has a UV protected shade. And you can even open the back so she can get some airflow. But we'll see if she likes it when she wakes up. We got this set up. We pulled the chairs out and placed her tent right in front and she has been entertained for a minute. Daddy over there chilling already. <gasps> you have your own private tent? Okay, VIB, very important baby. You want more? More breakfast sandwich? So Rhea needed some water for her formula. And we went to the duty free and all they had was spring water. So we had to go into the Starbucks and get their overpriced purified water. And it comes in this can. So we're heading to the Ville, AKA Aquaville. It's Aquaventure. Aquaville, just the veal, it sounds better. So we're heading to Aquaventure, um, where the slides are, bigger pools. Bigger kids are here, but we just kind of want to check it out. Uh, I think Rhea still have a good time. Mm -hmm. A few more restaurants. Oh. Excuse me, honey. Um, so well, yeah. We're mainly here to find food. lunch. And I want to see the big slide that everyone raves about. We're going to take turns and be big kids. So we're waiting out in the rain, but as you guys saw, Ryan went on the Leap of Faith. That's the name of that slide. I still have yet to try it. I kind of want to maybe try it a different day. It's hard when we got this little one to watch. She's just in her stroller chilling. Eating her quackers. As always, your favorite quackers? Yeah. But I feel like we got a lot done and it's only what, 1, 1.30? One uh, so... We're gonna head back whenever this rain passes. We're gonna head back to, back to our room, let Rhea take a nap and shower and all that stuff. Then when we get up, I think we're gonna go to the aquarium and the dinner. But this resort is a lot bigger than we thought. Well, I mean, it's like a really big shared resort. But yeah, it's maybe five different hotel slash resorts. Um, you got the Cove and the Reef, which are the two main ones, I think. Then you got Coral. And I don't know what the other two are. Two other random ones. Um, and it's like a big shared island. Uh, yeah, island. Of course, we're 
pools and slides. Water park. Water parks and all that between all the resorts. So it's cool, you're meeting a lot of people. Also, I met a few people that was coming from a, um, from a cruise. So the cruise back here, they're also like kind of chilling at the resort, so it's nice. There's a lot that we still have yet to find. Food is average though at the resort. So average, but pricey. <laughs> they need better options. Very, very pricey. They only have water for my baby girl. Mm -mm -mm. So we are going to the aquarium. Which is actually inside of another one of the resorts at the Royal. If the Little Mermaid had a Vegas, this would be it. <laughs> well, because it's like sea life. Oh. Fish are huge. They could eat Rhea. Look at how big those fish are. Is she scared? Oh. See, Mr. Krabs. Walking through the Marina Village has a ton of shops and restaurants. Are you watching Daddy? Daddy filled up the tent with water for you. Did not look easy. Good morning. This is the third day, second four day. We're at the beach right now. Ray is planning her little playpen. and she's chilling. I just went on a half quarter mile run. Nothing. Just kind of jog around the beach, get the blood flowing. Um, it's not as sunny as we would like, but it's a nice day. Early. It, it is early. It's not even nine o'clock yet. Day, Only a few people are out at the beach, so that's nice. Um, so yeah. Later today we have Dolphin K, or Cave. So Ray is gonna get a chance to swim with the dolphins and enjoy that experience. So talk to you later. Can I go to Jelly Time? Jelly Time. Jelly Time. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. Mommy and Daddy were too busy drinking their Bahama Mama and Rum Runny that we we got our appointment wrong for the Dolphin K. So it was supposed to be 11:45, or no, it was. We thought it was at two, but it was supposed to be at 11:45. I don't know where I got 2 p.m. from. Like something is supposed to happen at 2 p.m. I don't know what it is at this point. So obviously we're not gonna make the 2 p.m. appointment for whatever it is. Oh, they got rock climbing. We're gonna go 
schedule upon the rocks. But um, thankfully we were able to reschedule for tomorrow at nine, unfortunately. It, unfortunately, it might rain tomorrow, so we're just gonna have to see how things go, but then they said we could reschedule it again, so hopefully we can make it. Look at how big this is. Oh, yeah. Apparently this is a small portion, but this is still huge. It's the next morning and we are on our way. Hi. To the dolphin cave. Almost forgot to press the button in the elevator, but since we missed our appointment, or whatever, our time slot yesterday, we're going today. Didn't vlog much yesterday, but I went down the very scary slide. What is it called? The leap of faith. That was probably the most adventurous thing I've done since being pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> but it wasn't bad. Are you excited? Yeah. It is raining. So we'll see how that goes. Are you worried? Uh, a little. I, am. I think we could have we could stick it out if it was just yeah, us. Yeah, obviously. But we have Raya. I did bring her pool hat, so it's not raining too bad. I'm hoping it just lightens up. Just enough so that she doesn't freak out. Um, so we don't want her to have a bad experience. It's not worth it at that point. Yeah, unfortunately the weather was better yesterday. So had we made our original time slot, we could have been okay, but you know, still high hopes. And we'll tell y'all how it goes, cause clearly we are not taking the camera to the dolphins, but hopefully we can get some pictures. We just finished seeing the dolphins and it was so cute. Rhea wasn't scared. I truly don't think she understood what was going on, but hey, it's okay. We'll experience this again when she's older. Rhea has her fruit pouch, and mommy and daddy have their drinks. Dun, dun. Cheers. Is it good? So we decided to leave the resort. We just needed to. We wanted to get a more genuine experience. So we came into the city. Uh, we have a place called Fry. So it's a compilation of tons, a ton of restaurants. So you got maybe 20, 30, 40 restaurants, bars, etc. We have all the locals here. So people are partying, people are eating out. Um, we're amongst the locals now. It, 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 Hopefully it's a good experience. Like prices are obviously a lot lower than normal prices. We're not paying resort prices for food. Um, I'm sure the portion's gonna be larger. Well, it, it's kind of refreshing to get off the resort for a little bit and just get a genuine experience. Raya's over here just being Raya. I got me a nice little drink here and just ordered one too. So let's see how the food is. It's our last full day. Yesterday, we didn't really leave you off with much because once we had dinner, we were all in like a food coma. So after that, <laughs> we got back, put Ray to sleep, and we took our butts to sleep too. But today is our last full day. Uh, we're just kind of packing some things right now before we have to go get our COVID test to go home. And then, Looks like we're gonna have another pool day. We still, I don't think we planned out today very much, um, but we're just gonna try and enjoy the last day as much as we can. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, buffet today so I got a little bit of everything and Ray is eating the sweet potato fry. You like the asparagus? It's the 
asparagus yummy? Yeah? Oh, you want more food? You want more food? Are you happy that we went to the buffet today? I'm very happy. Now, obviously, we have the options. It's like any other, other, any other buffet. I haven't been to a buffet in so long, so it's kind of interesting. The it's just bringing it like childhood memories. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's, it's very reasonably priced. Um, eat whatever you want. And obviously, we can dessert, give stuff to Raya. Free drinks, free stuff for Raya. Uh, I wish we would have found it earlier because we probably would have eaten it two or three times. Just because of the variety and the quality of the food is it's pretty much the same. You can't like get your steak cooked how you want it because it's already cooked. Right. You can't order like special sushi. They just have like sushi pre-made, but it's fresh. So. Seventy bucks, seventy-five dollars a person. Spending more than that per okay. person, getting a quarter of the food at other places. So we're gonna take our time here. Yep. Yeah. We got unlimited drinks, unlimited dessert, unlimited vibes. Unlimited vibes. Good people, <laughs> good folks in here. Yeah. <laughs> Fossil Prime.